Have you ever thought of going into the past and changing it? What if I were to tell you that you can do a phone call to your own past? How it would be if it was possible? So here's a video for you about how a phone call to the past would work. Firstly, we need to understand the concept that signals are electromagnetic waves that travel at the speed of light. It takes no time on Earth to reach from one place to another to send a signal. So, we are planning to send signals faster than those which travel now. But, you might have heard that light speed is the speed limit of the universe, and no object can travel faster than light. So, how to send a signal that is faster than light? Okay, leave that. Before these, we have to think about relativity. When an object travels faster, its mass increases. So, when mass increases, we need more energy to move that object as its velocity reaches closer to speed of light. So, sending anything faster than light is merely impossible. But, wait, what is the reason behind photons which travel at light speed without any energy? They do have zero rest mass. So, as mass equals zero, they only have kinetic energy. So, there is some sort of hypothetical particle known as tachyons which have negative mass. Negative mass is the hypothetical idea that matter can exist with mass of the opposite sign to the normal stuff. The symmetrical law of nature force us to think theorize the existence of negative mass. The symmetrical law of nature says that when a physical quantity has a positive value, it should have negative value too. Such as matter and antimatter, gravity and anti-gravity, and other things. So, with negative mass, the particle always travels faster than light. As it travels faster, time goes reverse in direction for such particle, so these propagating particle would send data to the past. Cool? But there are some paradoxes stating that it is impossible for an effect to occur before its cause. For example, you can't die due to an accident before the accident took place. As these tachyons violate this law, and some other paradoxes, tachyons are hence categorized as particles which are not allowed to convey signals. So, what do you think about the idea of making a phone call to your own past? Leave your comments below, and share the video. Thanks for watching.